Hello. Excuse me, she said, raising her arms up and bustling quickly between the two of us, turning to smile impishly. Through the gap, the careful two metre gap that the two of us wearing masks had left. And I could see that she was grinning because she wasn't wearing a mask. As if what she was doing was cute or clever. Cyclists do the same thing. Cycling quickly past you on the pavement, far too close, puffing and panting as they go up the hill. And it makes me wonder, is what I'm doing worthwhile? Is there any use in it? My small effort. Jesus told a story, a parable, about something very small, which grows very large. It's a parable about the kingdom of heaven, and he likened it to a mustard seed. You'll find it in Matthew's Gospel, chapter 13. The kingdom of heaven is like a mustard seed that someone took and sowed in his field. It's the smallest of all the seeds, but when it has grown, it is the greatest of shrubs and becomes a tree so that the birds of the air come and make nests in its branches. I don't know what Jesus 2000 years ago was thinking of when he called it a mustard seed. What we call a mustard is not only not the smallest of seeds, but it doesn't grow into a large shrub. But Jesus clearly had something in mind. He said the kingdom is like that. That tiny, tiny seed. That tiny effort. When someone does the right thing, almost unnoticed. The tiny step. The smallest of efforts. And it grows. Is it worth me wearing my mask? Yes. Is it worth me making an effort? to stay two metres apart from my fellows? Yes. Is it worth me being kind and considerate? Yes. Is it worth me believing in Jesus? Yes. The kingdom of heaven is like that tiny effort, the tiniest of seeds, which when planted and nourished, of course, by God, it grows and grows until the birds of the air can perch in its branches. Keep safe.